So I got the grill torn off of this thing last night. And it's actually an aftermarket grill. I don't know if I mentioned that or not, but since it's aftermarket, this middle bar comes apart. So I sanded off all that old paint that that guy had on there with like a brush or whatever and just sand that all off. And I just rattle canned it quick. So still waiting for that to dry really good so I can put it back together. But I'm going to install that today. And I, I'm also going to swap the headlights. Those are the OEM ones off my other truck that I just replaced. These are all aftermarket. And the main reason is because this one looks like it's got some spray paint in or something. But I don't even know how you do that. But we'll swap those over. And then what I think I'm going to do is take off these Silverado badges just because they're already like falling off so I'll probably take off the 4x4 stickers and for sure the Chevrolet on the back and also while I'm waiting for that grill to dry better I probably replace this handle too because there's a little crack in this one since I only had about five sets of these off of old trucks that I've had that I replaced with painted handles but I'm not gonna do that on this truck just save a little money it doesn't have to be that nice We'll start by swapping the headlights over real quick. I'll just fast forward through this since I just made a video about the headlight install. So. so I figured since I had those OEM ones laying around, I'd just throw them on there. Not a very big change there, but they're all clear now and got rid of that ugly spray painted one. So get all that residue off and the residue from the stickers over there. I'm going to use 3M adhesive remover or adhesive cleaner. I have a little, little spray bottle here so I don't just dump it all over the side to pick up. We got all the adhesive off and just to make sure I can get that outline off I'm going to hit that with the buffer a minute. Should be able to get it off. Got really outlined. I made that little spot look a lot better than the rest of the truck. But it's just a work truck. Got the other side done. So I'll move on to the 4x4 stickers now and the tailgate. There you go, it's gone. I'm gonna use some adhesive remover like I was using earlier. Just clean up that tiny bit of adhesive left over and then go over with the buffer a little bit. I'm sure you can tell, I don't know if you can tell, it's perfectly shiny under the sticker and then not over there. Came out pretty good. I'm not trying to restore the paint on this whole thing, but just want to get rid of that outline of the sticker. Not bad. So I got the passenger side off and I just wanted to show this little scrape dent type thing. I'm not going to get the dent out, but I'll just show a little before and after on the polish on it. See how good that comes out. As you can see there, still see the 4x4 outline. A little better. Didn't quite get it all, but just really wanted to get rid of that 4x4 outline, so looks good. Let's move on to the tailgate now. The heat really helps to get a little warmth on it. Don't want to get it too hot, so just fast forward through getting this off.
Well, here's a good example of how easy it is to see these letters now. So we'll go ahead and polish that out now. So obviously I could spend a lot more time on this, but it's just not worth it to me. It's probably going to be dirty more than it's clean, so looks good for the most part. We got the center bar back in the grill. Looks decent. I still might get a new grill, but I'm just going to slap it in now. It looks a heck of a lot better than it did before. So I'm down to finding a hood now. Because that looks awful against everything else. So as soon as it stops raining, I'll go outside and get a walk around of all the stuff I did. See what it looks like. So it quit raining for a little bit, so I figured I'd come out here and do another little walk around. So just to recap, I did. I changed the headlights over to my OEM ones off my other truck. I painted the center bar on the grill like you saw. Took the Silverado badges off behind the doors. Took the 4x4 stickers off. And I took the Chevrolet off the tailgate. Also replaced the passenger side door handle. It's had a crack in it, so. Looking better already. Definitely need to find a hood. I should have just bought a tailgate cap when I did the bed caps, but I think I'll just keep looking for one. Might find one like I have my other truck from a salvage yard. Otherwise I'll just get a, another aftermarket one to match the bed caps. I uh, may or may not at some point get a new back bumper. I definitely still have to do something about the front bumper too. So stay tuned for the next video. Also got some interior stuff to do. Thanks for watching.